Hey, what's up, everyone? Staff Sergeant Vorpal here, doing something a little bit different, okay? I have uh, Private First Class Samuel Kostriva. He's back here right now. I'm recruiter's assistant, helping me out, doing my thing, spreading the good word, but I wanted to do an impromptu kind of Q&A session, all right? Because about two years ago, he was exactly where a lot of you are, and also um, where some of you are going to be or have been um, in, in your life. Uh, he was there too, so um, I guess with that, PFC Kostriva, what led you to choose the path that, that you currently are on? You know, um, personally for me, um, I wanted to go to college, but I always wanted to serve, I always wanted to, or wanted to be in the military. So, um, you know, I gave college a try, didn't like it, was planning on doing the reserves, but eventually decided to go active duty. Um, you know, there's really nothing I don't like about the Marines. I mean, you know, the camaraderie, you know, the, the skills you get out of it. Um, you know, just, just the, the vibe in the Marine Corps is like, everything about it is great. <laughs> the vibe? The vibe. <laughs> it's, it, it's one of those things you have to experience, yeah. right? You know, they, they, they say teamwork, uh, you know, from, from my experience. It's been more than just teamwork. It, 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 you, you end up becoming a family with complete strangers, right? Uh, and they become your, your brothers and sisters who exactly. you do anything for. Got you. Um, so in, in your short amount of time, you've been back, what, about two weeks now, right? On recruiter's assistance. Um, and that's where he gets to come home, be home, just help me out a little bit and, and be around friends and family. But in your little bit of time that you've been back here, you know, um, talking to individuals that were in your shoes and you were in their shoes, right? Um, whether it be senior or just graduated or graduated in a couple years, uh, what ha what's a trend that you have seen uh, since being back? You know, um, there's two major things that I've noticed. Uh, one is that, you know, coming in and talking about it is not does not necessarily mean that you're enlisting. You know? Okay. I mean, just right. So nobody wants to like, like learn more about it. And, like, I mean, it doesn't make sense to me that people don't want to learn it. Like, a very viable option for the future. I mean, like people just kind of ignore it. Okay. Or they try and push it aside. I mean, um, the other thing I noticed is that, um, you know, people like me, like, like when I was in these people's shoes, um, you know, people don't just, they just like, want to take the jump. Like, like, I want to do it. I really want to do it. I was the exact same way. Like, I really, really want to join the Marine Corps, but I just didn't jump into it. Just do it. So, I mean, you just gotta, you know, find that inner strength and just go in, okay. get it started. Got it. So, so it's like just pull the trigger. Exactly. You know, you're, you're already pulled back in a slingshot, just release. Exactly. And then watch you freaking skyrocket. Yep, I mean, your parents might try and stop you, but that's one of the points you gotta say. It's like, no, this is something I wanna do and I wanna go. Like, my parents originally, they, they weren't having it. <laughs> I remember, I remember. Yep. But, you know, now that I'm in the Marines, like, they're, they're more proud of it than I am. Okay. Um, so kind of kind of t taking a step back to what you first said, you know, um, actually looking at it as a viable option, right? Why, because you said you, you went to college, tried that route. Why didn't you just look at that right away and just go headstrong and, and you went out and, and did college? Well, I mean, for me, like, I mean, I, I always wanted to be in the military, but um, I promised my mother I'd give college a try. Um, you know, I mean, that's just, it's, it's the standard, like, after high school, you're supposed to go to college. Okay. It's not something that generally people think about. They don't go like, what about the military? Um, so, I guess, it's about So, it's just like, hey, everyone's going to college. And then you got, you got your, your mom, dad, family, whoever, yep. just telling you, hey, go, right? It's the um, standard. It's what you're supposed to do. Okay. Uh, lo looking back now, right, two years later. If you could yourself right now go back and talk to your two year ago self, what would you suggest when he was making that decision now? Do it earlier. I mean, if, if there's any doubt in your mind that college is not right for you, then you should already be in the office. Like, okay. So it's gonna like, hey, if, if you're like, hey, I don't know if I even wanna go to school, don't, don't just go because someone else tells you to go. Right. Um, do what you wanna do. It's not up to anybody else, it's your future. Okay, got it. So, so really, take charge of your future, make that first adult decision in your life exactly. and, and, and go, you know, all in. Right. Right. All right. Um, is there any other last thoughts, words, anything like that, that you would want them to know about anything? It doesn't have to be Marine Corps related, just about anything. Um, you know, before, before I joined Marine Corps, I was kind of like, meh about myself, but you know, now that I'm in, 
I'm a Marine, I'm proud of myself and you know, I don't want to be anywhere else, so. Got it. All right, well, I appreciate it. All right. So just uh, impromptu Q&A, none of that was scripted. Uh, you know, take someone if you think, you know, they're, they're, they're looking at it uh, as an option or they're not, or you think they should learn more, take your parents in it, okay? Here, straight from the horse's mouth, guys. All right, I've been in the Marine Corps nine years. Uh, he, he's going on literally just under a year now. He gave college a try, uh, found out it wasn't for him, took charge of his life, and now he's doing what he wants to do. So, um, like I said, like, comment, share. You can find him on Instagram, all right? Just look up Samuel Kostriva. Uh, his name will be in the comments, all right, in the description. And uh, yeah, appreciate you tuning in.